Yo, Saka Fed, I'm Sammy Beast. Today I'm going to show you how to create a dope Amapiano instrumental in FS Studio 21. It's not gonna be a deep Amapiano instrumental, it's gonna be an Asake, Iwasta, and Loj type vibe. Let's have some fun. Let's fix our tempo. We're gonna go with something like 115 and load lounge, lounge laser, and then let's try to create those chords. Um, let's start with this one. This one's gonna be our first chord. It's gonna be a B sharp minor. Bam, boom. Let's try this. To see. And then we go down here. And then let's create this right there. Like something like this. Nice, sound nice, guys. And now we're gonna try to make it sound more interesting. You will see the difference when you play, when you uh, write the chord with your mouse, and if you play it. For example, let me play the first chord for you. And then if I play with my MIDI keyboard, it's gonna sound like this. And then, you see the difference? So, one of the methods that I use, if I'm struggling trying to find my chord progression with the piano, I just write them um, with my mouse, and then after, I'll delete them, and then I we play them. For example, the first chord, chord, let's say that we're gonna play it. We hit on record, and then, see sound way different and then this second one gonna be this chord it was it was this one right here and then the next one gonna be this one right here And then the last one gonna be sorry let me so simple like that guys now you can see the difference if i play it sound way more interesting nice and now guys, we're gonna transpose some of the notes so we can give it this Ama Piano feel, Ama Piano vibe. Let's see if we transpose only this one. And then, maybe let's transpose this instead. Nice. And then transpose this one. And maybe on this one, I'm gonna transpose this. Nice, nice guys. Woo! Nice. And the next thing gonna be uh let me just add a kid. I'm gonna try to find a nice uh vocal chop in our kid and then something very interesting, something simple, not complicated at all. A shop minor. So let's go. Okay, guys, so simple like that. Okay, we have it like that. I love it. I love it. And the next thing gonna be adding uh, purity. Purity is really good for Ama Piano guys. And let's go to preset. Go to slow set. I'm gonna use the for now. Let's use the tremolo, tremolo signal. And don't forget we are on A shop. 
Let's see how it sound. Simple like that. Love it already. And now uh, I think I'm gonna start by adding. Um, I have some new thing coming, guys. Stay tuned for that. Add some. I have some new crazy thing. Ooh. And now let's add some perk. Hmm. Let's go to Afro perk. Let's use this one so we can give it this nice Afro beat vibe. Open a new simple and start right here. Oh, okay. And then go to Afrobeat Essentials Bondo, go to Kaza, let's use some conga. Maybe let's use this one. And then let's go with clear and find a kick. So simple like that. Our kick gonna be simple like these guys. And now let's find and then we will move this one and we duplicate it simple so simple guys and now guys we're gonna add some conga to make it sound more interesting and then um find some snare let's use the basic one So nice, so nice, so simple, guys. On this one, I see that the vocal don't fit on the tempo. We're gonna go and then click on the Azuzio clip. And then go take this vocal and then we're gonna make it fit perfectly. Nice. Sound better now. Now we're gonna add the bass and then after we're gonna go to the next part of the instrumental. Nice. Hey. Nice. I love it. I think I'm gonna just put this one one octave lower. Sound better. <laughs> Let's duplicate this. This one. Let's clone this pattern and then I have this the pattern too. On the pattern too, I'm gonna uh, definitely make it sound more interesting by, um, let me see. First, I'm gonna remove this mute guitar and let's go to the Afrobeat Essentials Volume 2, go to Crash. Let's use the, this one. Because I want vibe. something simple something like that and uh for this one uh let's go to vibration and then let me use this one right here so simple with and use this let's use this vintage one And then right there, guys, uh, I am going to transpose this one, one octave higher. Nice, nice, guys. It's pretty nice. I'm going to keep this one right here, too. Now, guys, I'm going to add a violent melody to make it really sound more interesting, to bring this soulful vibe.
simple like that guys at uh, gms and then i'm gonna use the classic d tool okay let's look at that real quick Now guys, let's start adding those uh 808. Ah, those log jumps, sorry. So go to uh Fluty DX10. I have some presets, some nice presets for you guys. Uh let's use this one. Boom boom dun. Dun, 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 dun. Dun, 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 dun. Okay, um Let's do this way. Something simple like that. Okay, another thing we can do, duplicate this one. And then we're gonna combine two uh, of my preset. Let's go to the bars that have sustain. And then we're gonna play like. Go to sell. It's like we're gonna play it till the log jump. Maybe we can go. And then we go right here. Boom, boom. Okay, now we're gonna add the other drum. And then right here, we're gonna maybe create a, create a, a wall right here. Something long like this. Take it like this, and then we. Uh, tum something simple like boom boom. And also, guys, we're gonna combine it with another log jump again. Let's use the uh, log vibe this one and for example right here and then we can have it right here i don't want this one to be by itself maybe we can combine Guys, I love the log drum for now, and I'm not gonna complicate it at all. Now we're gonna add another um, lead so we can combine it with what we already have. Let's open Nexus to do that. We're gonna go to the factory preset, go to lead, and then let's use this one. And then it's gonna be. Sorry, let's go right here. Yeah, guys, I think I think I have to do some little game and then it's gonna sound really crazy. So let me do that real quick. Guys, uh, I spent some time on it and then here's how it sounds. First thing, the, the thing that I do, I just add some melody to this uh, e-piano. Let me show. 
make it sound more interesting that's gonna be a mellow part so simple like that guys and then all together they sound like this enjoy That's it guys, thanks for watching. I hope now it's easier for all to create dope ama piano instrument on NFL Studio 21. If you have questions, please leave a comment down below. See you guys.